Still no sign of Terra. her what oh I'm sorry it's just I've never seen anyone so beautiful who are you I'm Ventus but you can call me Ven oh you don't seem bad dear I'm certain you have a pure heart just like our precious Aurora can you tell me why she's sleeping long ago Maleficent cursed her now she's stolen her heart. Hmm. Well then, why don't I go get it back for her? That's impossible, dear. Maleficent's home is at the Forbidden Mountain. It's not safe. I'm not afraid. We, we can't just leave Aurora like this. I can help. You gotta believe me. Come on, let's go get her heart. You know, you're absolutely right. The Forbidden Mountain is through the forest. Come along, follow us. After all, we wouldn't want you to get lost. doing. Master Yen Sid. My name is Terra. Yes, Ericus's pupil. I've been expecting you. 
It is the unversed. Yes, Master Yen said. I thought it best to seek the counsel of one wiser than myself. I am no longer a master. I doffed that mantle. But sir, wasn't that your pupil I passed on the way in? He had a keyblade. You refer to Mickey. He too sought guidance here. As a king, he is good and kind, but the weight of a crown has not cured him of impetuousness. He has left with an object whose power he does not understand nor know how to control. Mickey imagines my star shard will be of help in his current quest, and like you, he is eager to use his keyblade to set things right. I'm not sure I even understand what's wrong. Master Xehanort is missing. And now I've learned, there's a masked boy who is controlling those unversed on the loose. To arrive at the truth, perhaps you should approach things differently. First, consider them one and the same problem. Master Xehanort and the unversed are connected somehow? I must not make assumptions. Find Xehanort, Terra. That is where you should begin. Yes, sir. I had hoped, Xehanort, your heart would no longer lead you astray. That should do it. Don't you remember? We've met before. We... we have? Why, of course, you said so yourself. Once upon a dream. I never thought I would meet you. Outside of my dreams, that is. Who are you? What's your name? Hmm? Oh, my name. Why, it's... Oh, oh no, I can't. Goodbye. I must see you. I don't know. Maybe someday. When? Tomorrow? Oh, no. This evening. At the cottage in the Glen. What was that? Aurora's memory. She must have gotten her heart back. So her dream came true? Yes, not long ago. Dreams are very strong beliefs. Aurora's led her to her true love. I see you hold strong beliefs too, don't you, dear? Yep. You also have a strong light. Hmm. All right, hurry. We can't stay here. What's that? I think I'd better go take a look inside. Someone has released Aurora's heart. Tell me, child, was it you? Maleficent! 
only because you stole it in the first place. A keyblade? You must be Ventus. Huh? How do you know about me and the keyblade? My powers ensure I'd know of the key to bringing me hearts. Terra gave me a demonstration. <laughs> Terra? He was here? Why, yes. In fact, it was he who stole Princess Aurora's heart. That's a lie! I was asked to leave you unharmed, but it seems I have no choice! There's no way Terra would hurt somebody like that. You don't believe me? That's unfortunate, for he agreed so easily. He did? Ven, don't be fooled! Huh? Aqua! Terra would never do that. You know that as well as I do. Yeah. Ah. The truth can be most cruel, even amongst the closest of friends. After all, one never knows the secrets of another's heart. I'm sure you'll agree, Ventus. Aqua. The Master sent me. Huh? Then, let's go home. But Terra... Terra's not ready to leave yet. Like, like right, right now, now he's, he's leaving, leaving you behind. behind. And by the by time, time you time catch, you catch up, up, he'll be a, be a different, different person. person. <sighs> Sorry, Aqua. But I can't go with you. What? It's just... 
I have to find him before it's too late. Then I see you too wield a keyblade. How do you know about the keyblade? A source of power. A key that opens the hearts of men, of entire worlds, and allows one to obtain anything and everything. Such a power I find most fascinating. So, Terra... He really? Yes. Now, my dear, would you like to assist me as well? Never! I see. Xehanort was right. You are a most stubborn girl. Master Xehanort, how do you... It seems you need time to consider my offer. Fortunately, I have the perfect place. What? Are you? <sighs> Who are you? My name is Aqua. It looks like I was caught in a trap. Why are you here? To prevent me from breaking her evil curse. I was to meet the most beautiful girl at a cottage in the Glen, but now my true love lies in an eternal slumber, and only I can break the spell. You must really love her. Is what you said true? Yes. Maleficent told me. Oh, Prince Philip, it's you! Now, Philip. The road to true love may be barred by many more dangers, which you alone will have to face. I'm going with you. There's something I need to know, and Maleficent has the answer. Yes, of course, dear. Now come along. We must hurry to Aurora. shall be your tomb, wound round the castle in a bower of doom! <laughs> Maleficent, what did Master Xehanort tell you? Such a pity, child, that you don't have Terra's gift for obedience. Nor can you see how easy it was for him. Terra would never do anything to help you! Quite the contrary. He fully embraced the darkness within himself. Stop lying! See for yourself all the powers of hell! Yeah! 
I swear, not as weak as I will not fail you again. It's the power of true love that defeated you. I will not be defeated by something as insignificant as love. You don't even know the first thing about it. You're too clouded by darkness to see that there's something greater. Try all you want, but you'll never defeat a heart filled with light. Perhaps. But remember one thing. As long as there is light, there will be darkness. And in time, many more will be drawn to it. Then they will all belong to me! <laughs> Tara, you better stay strong for me. Master Xehanort! Terra! Come see me at once! 